So today what we're going to do is show you how to fix the most unusual problem to getting a Docker to run. And this includes Dockers like OpenVPN and Plex transcoding. Here we go now. And a special thank you to all my patrons, including my newest patron, Hisham Altmudlag, who without your support, this channel would not be possible. And if you haven't already, please think about supporting the channel you love. Thank you. So welcome to Technodad Life, where we make technology simplified. And today what we're going to be doing is removing NoExec. And so NoExec is a file specifically made to make executables not runnable on a system, but it also prevents certain programs from working. And so those are things like Plex and the media transcoding it does and OpenVPN. And so if you use anything like that, then you need to run this. So let's get started. The first thing we need is to have PuTTY downloaded and installed. Next, we need our Open Media Vault up and running. Open PuTTY, type in your IP address, and that's the IP address that shows up in the browser there. Next, click Open, and then log in as root and your password. So now what we're going to do is edit the Open Media Vault config file, so then we can remove that no exec. So we need to type in nano space slash etc slash open media vault slash config dot xml and then hit enter. And so this will bring, bring about the config file. Next we want to press F6. And if you look down here at the bottom now there's a search bar. And so we're going to type in mntent, -E hit enter. And so we need to scroll down to this area, and in particular, there is the no exec that we want. So down arrow, put your cursor on the N, and then delete. Next, hit Control X and Y to save the changes, and then hit Enter. Next, type in OMB Salt. Deploy run Fs tab, hit enter. And here down at the bottom, you can see it says three saved or three succeeded, excuse me. Then type in reboot, hit enter. And now it's time for a cup of coffee while that does that. And you can actually log out or not log out, close PuTTY at the same time. So we're going to log back into our server with PuTTY, log in as root and your password. And now here, if you use the up arrow, you can go back to the commands that you put in before. And so we're just gonna up arrow till we get to the nano slash etc. Then hit enter. And then again, uh, F6. And we have the search and then type in M-N-T-E-N-T, -E hit enter. And if we scroll down, we can see now the we can see the no exact is no longer there, so we did it. If you like this video today, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that bell button, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.